match. It's going to be a good one, 120 pounds. We're going to see Nick Suriano and Dayton Fix take to the mat number one and number two, New Jersey versus Oklahoma. I'm ready. These guys had a little bit of tension at the uh, press conference themselves, and uh, they want blood. Yeah, the Fix want to take down this match in Akron at, uh, at Field of Cadet Worlds, and so this will be fun. All right. We'll throw it over to our ring announcer and get this one going. Ladies and gentlemen, the following match is presented by Flips Wrestling. This match is scheduled for three two-minute periods at 120 pounds. Introducing first the man wrestling out of the green corner, a two-time state champion and two-time Super 32 finalist. He is also a two-time beast champion, wrestling out of New Jersey and ranked number one in America, Nick Suriano. His opponent wrestles out of the blank corner, a cadet world team member and two-time Fargo champion, wrestling out of Oklahoma and ranked number two in America, Dayton Fitz. in the black, Suriano in the green. And this is gonna be a good one. Like we were saying in the tail of the tape, this matchup happened at Fila Cadet Trials. Fix one on a shot clock, or one one match on a shot clock violation point. So no takedowns between these two. Very similar stylistically, Bader. Yes. Fix working those hands. Suriano coming out, tapping him, slapping him on the head right away. And I anticipate a physical bout here between the two of them. Both of these kids really like to bang on the head, press forward, high pace. Suriano has as good of a gas tank as any wrestler in the country. And he's he's confident. He's as confident um, probably as almost anybody I saw last <laughs> night, yesterday afternoon in that press conference. Nick Suriano has a lot of that North Jersey culture in him. Right. Uh, he's got a little attitude, a little chip on his shoulder. Ab and he wants to prove he's number one. Action. And that's why these guys take this match, you know? He's got the number one ranking. He doesn't have to come out here, but he wants to lay it on the line and prove it. And I'm sure there's also a little bit of a revenge factor based on what happened in Absolutely. Akron a few months back. Uh, but you're right. There's, it's a testament to all these kids to take this bout. It's in October. Their season hasn't really Action kicked off man. yet. Um, and they're out here for high, high-level matches. And we see a couple shot attempts there by Dayton Fix. Able to get past the head, but not the hands. He kind of taps the leg of Suriano, but he can't get in on anything solid yet. And there's those heavy hands for Suriano. Again, another shot attempt by Dayton Fix. Another one, three, four attempts, though he's not getting anywhere with him. He continues to press forward. Yeah, hasn't had an opportunity yet to really commit to something. Doesn't really have an angle. Action, more man. level Let's changes that busy. Suriano's not reacting to. There he does it again. High crotch attempts. Good defense by Suriano. This time brings it down into a front headlock position. Pinch in there, he's got his butt to the center. Dayton Fix controlling the elbow. And we see good short offense by Suriano over on the edge. And that's gonna do it. The first period comes to a close, no go. No guy even More really action, that close action, okay. to uh, getting the Black. score. Yeah, Suriano a little Top bit of offense the there in the Last end, but not, not a significant scoring attempt. Now this is one thing we did not see in Akron between these two, is their mat wrestling ability. Set. And Suriano Top. a good one on top. And immediately as you say that, Dayton Fix makes his way to his feet. Suriano though, bringing heavy pressure. Fix has a hand, kicks away, scores Neutral. the escape, leads one nothing, 10 seconds into the second frame. And so we'll go back to our feet here in. Not a ton of angles, it's been drive forward, drive forward. Half shot by Suriano, half attempt back at him by Fix. And we haven't even gone out of bounds yet in this match. Her pace is really high. As you say that, they near the edge. Same thing going here. And so we had kind of a, 
a, a, a little bit more high-paced high scoring affair anyways. Last match, we see the pace, at least the score, much lower in this one. Just one nothing here. Halfway through to about a minute to go in the second period. Um, and, and I was wrong. They didn't go out of bounds. They circled themselves back Action. into the center. <laughs> They're interest, certainly interested in wrestling. And this stylistically, I think, is what we expected. You know, be less of a, a flashy... Uh, a lot of leg attacks and more of a street fight yeah, between these two. They're grinding this one out, really. A lot of heavy hand fighting, a lot of position fighting. You know, trying to even get to those setups, the positions with their hands where you can take a shot. They've both been having a really both tough guys, time. Both guys, stall warning, both guys. Ooh, double stall warning. I don't think it's been a, because of lack of effort. I think it's just lack of ability to get, like I just said, to the positions where Come you can guys, take that shot, where you're Let's confident go, you can out, score. Yeah, neither out. guy's been able to create an opportunity uh, to even attempt something right now. Fix has done a couple level changes to at least appear more active. And that'll on, do it. Second guys, period comes to a close. And it's just one point Green's on the board. Down. That's for Dayton Fix. And Soriano is going to get his choice. He starts underneath and will have his chance to get that Set. point back. Hot. And again, Suriano tries to load into that from bottom. Now up and oh, away, so eight Cutting seconds away. in. Oh, and a low shot. It looked like Fix had touched the ankle. Suriano gets it out of the way. Uh, but and Suriano, could we be heading to overtime again? I that, know we're still a minute 40 away, but. That's kind of the way this one smells. It looks like Fix may have been caught underneath for a second there, but able to breath. I'm what? glad that was the way this match smells. I was, thought it was something else. Just kidding. Love it. <laughs> and we see inside Kai. Tie over collar tie. Pummeling in for the position. Controlling wrist. Interlocking the fingers now, which you see a lot more in freestyle. But these two, both studs in freestyle as well. Coming up on under a Action, minute to man. go now. Open up, guys. Suriano may have a handful of t Watch the fingers. There. Watch the fingers. Hey, he's a little, little Russian tie, and I don't mean the real kind. You mean the Sargush tie. <laughs> yeah. And Suriano controlling the center of the mat. Great defense. The second. Dayton Fix lowered his level. Suriano met him in a nice elbow pull. Dayton Fix kind of halfway got to his position, but got a little bit extended. He's going to go out of bounds. Just under 30 to go. 27 seconds left in regulation. We could be seeing overtime again. And nice job there by Suriano. Calmly square up, stuff Fix's head, and really prevent him from going anywhere. Uh, that's the first time anyone's touched a leg all match, Mark. Right. 15 seconds to go. Soriano coming forward Soriano again. Soriano kind of got halfway and didn't commit to that. Guys, and that'll do it. Now. So what are we in our third match of the night? You third match of the second night. Overtime? Second OT. And this one that. feels like it could challenge that infinite match from last, last year's who's and number one. And we see Dayton Fix takes a shot. Soriano defends. Nice job staying square by Dayton Fix. And, of course, it was his teammate, JoJo Smith. Overtime last match. Nice boot scoot attempt by Fix. And Fix has really turned it up here in overtime. I think he's starting to feel more confident. Maybe he's starting to get the feel of where those Shanks and Suriano's armor are defensively. Suriano digs an underhook on the left side. Fix backs out, clears that tie. And remember, both wrestlers have a warning. So a stall would end this match too. Not that I think an official would want to go in that direction unless it's blatant. Yeah, it's got, you got to turn around and run away. Fix with another attempt, over collar, shrug attempt. Takes Suriano to the edge. Have they gone out of bounds yet? They, I don't believe I don't they, have. they have. They've been, there we go. Finally, <laughs> with 89 minutes and four seconds to go in overtime. <laughs> that normal overtime would be going to the top bottom Watch portion faces, at this point. But we're going to stay on our feet until we determine a winner. And this is where you start to think. Are these guys waiting for the other one to score? Are they planning on scoring with counter offense? 
certainly it's going to happen sooner or later. Certainly, that's the way Suriano's game plans look like. Particularly, fix a couple times look like he looks like he's been close up, to getting guys. caught underneath on one of those shots. And I think Suriano's waiting for and anticipating that mistake fix makes. Packed house here in the snake pit on the campus of Lehigh University. Everyone on the edge of their seat, eagerly awaiting the outcome of this bout between these two hammers at 120 pounds, trying to determine who will take the number one spot. That's number one, Nick Suriano in the green. Number two, Dayton Fix in the black. And we've got a fantastic turnout tonight here in the snake pit. They're standing, hanging from the rafters. Every seat is full. Ooh, tried to power through him. I wouldn't call it a headbutt because he took a shot, but Dayton Fix kept his head right in the way. They met heads, that was. And Suriano has an angle. Fix squares up. And this is what you didn't get to see. What, in Akron where it was, it was 1-1 just as it is now. Who's going to get the takedown? And there's it's Suriano going, going inside for trip on the Fix edge. For Suriano. Another inside yeah. trip is up for Suriano. Fix throws him out. Fix slaps his hands, has a smile on his face as he moves back to the center. He's liking this. He's having fun out there, and that's what you want to see. And now we're wrestling. And yeah, that's also a personality difference there. You look how intense Suriano is going, going, going. Fix starting to feel it, starting to have fun. Might see a confidence wave after fending off that takedown and almost getting his own there on the edge. Absolutely. Jeff Buxton over in the corner for Suriano. Chris Perry in the corner for Fix. Uh, been a great turnout from the Oklahoma contingent this evening. As Fix, one of three guys from the Sooner State here on the Who's Number One card, plus Perry in our main event. We are just over three minutes into this overtime period. We're going to settle this, like you said, whether it's today or whether it's Thanksgiving, we're going to find a winner. I'm in. You have to think Suriano's gas tank may come into play here. He's one of the best conditioned kids, can really go into the third period or into the fifth minute of overtime. But he's going to need, to, he'll need to open up. Watch the face screen, watch the face. And there's a shot attempt by Fix, comes back up, controls the elbow, avoids danger. We march on, four minutes now, almost down in overtime. The Suriano trying to keep his hands on Fix. This is just like in the wrestling room when coach says, you guys can't leave till somebody gets a takedown. <laughs> and there's a shot by Suriano. He had the angle, he touched the foot, he had a hold of it for just a split second. And Suriano's body language is starting to show he's frustrated. I think he saw another one slip through his hands there. Literally. Yeah, literally. And Fix, nice job stepping right out. Shane Sparks getting the crowd into it. And look at that. A little bit of action again. Suriano stops it. And fix! Gosh, great level change! Now his head stuck underneath Suriano. Underhook, big underhook by Suriano. Tries for an ankle pick over on the edge. Inside, guys. And Suriano's been willing to show those high risk attacks when he's got the out of bounds line to work with. We're now over six minutes into OT. And the crowd's starting to chant, who wants it? Who wants it? And just like that, it gets almost silent. Like a, you can hear a pin drop in here. The tension starting to build up on the mat here as we're over five minutes. We're over five and a half minutes into overtime. That means we're over 11 minutes into this match. Snap oh, and there we go. Suriano gets in on a shot. Over on the edge. Dayton Fix defends with the wizard. Oh, my goodness. Fix lift legs out. And he's freed himself, backed up, square with him, head to head position. And how many. Oh, one way, the other way. Dayton Fix. It's a misdirection. He's in. 
Hot head on the outside, high crouch position, looking to finish. Will he hop over the body? It's the first time this entire match we've seen somebody in deep on a leg. Dayton Fix looking for the head. Suriano well aware of it, keeping his head up. Well, keeping his head away. And heavy hit by Nick Suriano. Dayton Fix in there. And I would love to see this one continue. He sprawls, gets his leg back. Could this be it? Who wants it more? Fix standing behind. Excuse me, Suriano's got Fix in trouble. Over on the edge. No, they're out of bounds. They're out of bounds. Oh. And again, you see Dane Fix slap his hands together. Somehow. And back to the center. Look at the crowd. They're on their feet. Uh, somehow both guys survived that flurry. I thought each was dead in about four different spots. And now you see Suriano start to take Dayton Fix towards the edge. Fix starting to look a little tired, as is Suriano, you gotta imagine. Yeah, this is Seven, where your six, conditioning really in. comes into play. Thirteen minutes in, one, one. We've seen guys, both guys in deep, looking to score, Back both guys center, with right, an opportunity. And the referee's gonna stop him, bring him back to the center. Each, each guy's bombed the other out of bounds. We've had now three fantastic flurries in overtime. And it's your mental conditioning as well as your physical conditioning Absolutely coming into play here. Absolutely, at this here. point, who can keep it together upstairs? Yep, because you're not used to being in matches this long. You're not used to concentrating against a high-level opponent for now 20, uh, coming up on 20 minutes. And both guys have done a fantastic job of keeping their composure, staying sharp, getting in these positions, and defending them exactly crisply, just like you're supposed to. And they fix the city! Oh, my gosh! What defense by Nick Suriano! Oh, and that's this is insane, Ian. This is insane. <laughs> and that is as close as you can come to dying without doing so. Uh, Suriano, just that second reaction. Whoa, that second reaction. Oh, time. now we see they fix it deep. Big hips by Suriano. I mean, beautiful shots, beautiful defense. This is everything you want to see. One of the most exciting 1 1 matches I've ever seen. Oh, my gosh. I don't know what to think. <laughs> Coming and up on 16 minutes. And this doesn't feel like it's going to end on a little slide by or a go behind. It's going to. Uh, this match will be fitting to end with some five point fireworks. Oh man, wouldn't that be something? And you can imagine whenever it does happen, somebody wins, this whole place is going to erupt. Whether you like who won or your guy who you wanted to win lost, everybody's gonna stand up and give this thing a big old round of applause because this has been some insane wrestling. Oh, it's been a fantastic high school match and you're right, I'm worried about the roof coming off of this place when somebody finally does make it happen and win. Well, that'd be really crazy because we're like three, four lowers down. <laughs> yeah, there would be lose <laughs> the entire upper wrestling room comes off of it. And you, 15 minutes, 30 seconds of wrestling. I know when I was in high school, our coach in college, coach would make us do 20 minute goes, sometimes 30 minute goes, and I don't think I ever had uh, one of those without a Action takedown guys. on me or, or getting my own. <laughs> Nor did you have one of those 20 minute goes broadcast coast to coast across the country. Right. Don't forget about our international friends. This is the World Wide Web. <laughs> yeah, you have yeah, all of our floor wrestling folks out there, you're being treated to a fantastic match here. We just broke the 16 minute mark. Looks like both guys catching a little bit of a break before we snap into another big flurry. Sorry, Action, guys, let's go. Working fixed towards let's the edge. Suriano, they're a little half shot. Looks like fatigue setting in a little bit. Action here. 
Had a shot there by Dayton Fix. And this is the definition of never quit. No, because right here. And these you guys, fall asleep for one second and it's going to be over. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You cannot stop paying attention at all. And I and you know what? It on, could guys. turn into Get more busy. of a mental. Let's go. Probably Get busy. is more of a mental than a physical battle at this point. And we have seen Suriano taking Dayton Fix towards the edge. I think that's just been kind of the styles. I don't think Dayton's stalling. I think he's just having a hard time getting offense going forward. Yeah, and Fix has been willing to commit to offensive attempts. There hasn't been the lack of action from his part. Suriano trying to get into a tie here. Fix doing a nice job hand fighting on that left side. Marathon match taking place right here in front of us in the snake pit. 2,000 rabbit wrestling fans watching this one and Fix in deep on the shot. Comes up to a high single. He's got Suriano in trouble. Suriano, great defense. Suriano, wow, warrior spirit in both of these guys. <laughs> That was that same misdirection shot we saw Fix get in on earlier. I think that's a little bit of an opening we can find. And you saw the relief in Suriano's body as he got out of that. I mean, again, and it has to be just mentally terribly frustrating for Fix to get that close and still not have a W. Suriano looking double unders. Was going to try to go for that inside trip. Takes a shot all the way on the edge. Now he gets to the leg of Fix, but Fix sprawls. Goes into a front headlock of his own. Loses that. We come back up. That was a nice little chain wrestling job there by Suriano. Uh, but just couldn't do much with the leg once he got there. And now we see Dayton Fix. He's the one now taking his butt to the center. Suriano close to the edge. Seen that opposite of that quite a bit. Action, guys. And I mean, it is like the second one guy attacks, the other one's defending. And we are 13 minutes into overtime. Yeah, coming up on a 20 minute match. And the body language on Suriano, he's starting to look a little tired. You wonder how much that big defensive flurry took out of and him. And now Suriano's in deep. He's over on the edge. He's got Fix kind of in trouble. He's got the leg Fix trying to limp leg through. <laughs> Stepping over, Sorry. trying to throw a leg. He still has that hand to bounce. Oh, my goodness. How many times? How many times are we going to see this where one guy's inches, inches from ending this match? And you only have so many of those big explosions of energy now at this point left. Both guys picking their spots a little bit, but the chance here for Fix to take advantage. Suriano's just had a big letdown and not be able to score. See if Fix can try and get him while he's on his heels a little bit here. And we are at the 20 minute mark. And this one might go to Thanksgiving. We were joking about that <laughs> during regulation. And here we see, oh, Dave Fix. Oh, going forward, looks for an inside trip on the edge. Oh, my goodness. You got to be kidding me. Oh. And both guys take a knee for just about a half a second and almost looked at each other like, can you believe this is happening? And fix those sprinting back to center, trying to at least look a little fresher, maybe plant that seed in Suriano's head. I've got more in the tank than you do. Uh. A world record was broken tonight. And I didn't think anything could go longer than that Nathan Boston match last year. This one, it, with no real end in sight, although that's not necessarily accurate as we've had a ton of these scoring opportunities. Just no one can finish Bader. Right, they're in deep on each other, back and forth, but both guys have such great defense. And they're throwing misdirections, upper body stuff, normal singles, inside trips, ankle picks. I mean, we've seen a wide variety of attacks and none of them can score. And both guys planted right in the center of the mat.
They move towards the edge again. This time it's Suriano pressing forward. And we mentioned these guys went without a takedown when they wrestled the cadet, cadets. And we're like, oh, we're definitely going to get a takedown, Drag a tapped. solid winner. Will it be an offense or a counter offensive score? That's the question. And the way this is going, I, I have the gut feeling it's going to be a counter just because the defense has been so good. And then the match is One going. way or the other. And as you say, it's a misdirection attempt for Fix. Suriano immediately out of the way. And you wonder if Fix may have gone to the well a little too many times on that. Suriano's been bit with it twice, now knows what he's looking oh, for. Nice stutter there. Suriano got fixed to react. Can he do it again? And then fire off an attempt right after that. Fixed. Megan. Coach is getting on him to keep his feet moving, getting a little stagnant in his motion. Now Suriano trying to press us forward. Yes, the crowd is starting to get up there. And then we see Dayton Fix in our shot. He said Suriano goes to the hips. Oh, what great hips. What great hips by Nick Suriano. Dayton Fix had him dead to rights. <laughs> oh my gosh. And now Suriano fires off an attack. Right back in on him. Dayton Fix. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. They're locked up. Wow. 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 I don't know. I don't know what to say, Ian. And I'm Dave kind of Fitz at a loss has got to be thinking, what do I have to do to score on this guy? He has been on deep on his legs more than... And they both just traded deep shots. Each guy, again, right there, ready to score. And Suriano did a nice job of taking advantage of that slight mental letdown you have right after you get a good opportunity and don't score. Uh, but Suriano then himself couldn't finish. Fix was able to pick himself up off the mat, get going, um, and get out of that deep double attempt by Suriano. Hit us up on Twitter. Who's going to win this match? You probably got plenty of time to get that tweet out. At Flow Wrestling, Suriano or Fix? Who you got? <laughs> I've never seen anything like this. Action, guys, here, let's go, mix it up. Neither guy given an inch. And still, both of them able to hold great position. Yeah, they're, you have not seen the breakdowns, no one's gotten sloppy. Fix takes a shot on the edge. Surrey out of defense. Come on. Go to center, Dave. Go to center. And Fix not letting Suriano back in bounds, stalking him over on the edge. And it's at this point it's willpower. Question is, will this thing go 30 seconds? I mean 30 minutes. 30 minutes? We're 10 minutes and 35 seconds away from hitting a half hour mark of overtime. No, we start at 90. We start at 90. Uh, Probably, we're only at, only at <laughs> 19 minutes and 30 seconds of overtime. And here we go, another shot attempt. Dayton Fix in deep, but the hips of Suriano keep him stopped. And we are now over 20 minutes into overtime. 26 minute long match. Suriano not want to let go of that chest Suriano lock. Suriano pulls it down, had an angle, was standing behind him. 
and, and slipped. He, yeah, he's indicating that his hand slipped off of him. Soriano looking a little bit frustrated, peeks over at his coach and what appeared to be frustration a couple times. He takes Dayton Fix towards the edge. Soriano fires off another shot. Dayton Fix defends. I'm sorry guys. Referee's gonna put him back into the middle. Almost 27 minutes in. Soriano look like he's getting a fistful of that fistful of shirt there on that collar tie. He needs to watch that. And another shot. I mean, it is inside chipped attempt by Fix. Just didn't quite have the length and the reach with his legs. Soriano checking something. Over Kyle Shrug attempt off the shot for Dayton Fix. Inside chip attempt for Soriano. Soriano came mighty close to scoring with that earlier. Now they're getting less and less effective with that big inside trip attempt. Yeah. What's the over under here on time? 40? I think that's a safe line. Fix now. Walking Suriano towards the edge. Suriano double from way out. Here we go, Suriano in on the legs. Can't quite elevate. And here we go. It's gonna scramble on the edge, and they're out of bounds. <laughs> and Fix looks like he's having a heck of a time. Soriano looks a little more frustrated. Uh, taking a ton of mental energy to stay in position, stay on the attack, have the kinesthetic awareness to oh, fight some fixed. of these shots off. Got put on a hip. Soriano. Starting to show a little bit of fatigue, perhaps. On the edge, Fix with a body lock. He lets go, takes a shot again. These guys are not afraid to fire off shot attempts. They're wrestling like warriors. If anything, the offense is way increased in overtime. And Fix maybe starting to pick up his pace a little bit here, feel a groove <laughs> inside. And we hyped up Suriano, certainly talked about Suriano's tank at the top of this. Fix looks to be the fresher wrestler here in OT. I'm getting tired watching this match. I'm getting yeah, I don't, worn out. I can't imagine these guys wrestling for nearly 30 minutes. I don't know how they're standing up, let alone wrestling. Suriano with an attempt, the second attempt. He's got fixed to the edge. Suriano taking another attempt. He's coming out the back door. Nick Suriano coming out now. He's got Jeff Bucks and his coach right in front of him, looking at him. Dayton Fix draped over the top, catches the ankles. Can Nick Suriano do it? Can he come out the back door? He reaches for that far hip. He's in position. Dayton Fix catches the ankle now. Fix has Suriano in the air. Fix has Can been. Fix bring it back to the center? Oh, and he loses it on the edge. Loses it. Unbelievable here. Uh, again, no idea how no one scores there. And 
Now we'll get blood time for Nick Suriano. Who I think is ble bleeding Five for a while clock, trying yes. to indicate it. Fix getting a huge drink there in the corner, taking advice. You stop it. Just lick it. Just lick it. Just lick it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. If you want to. If you want to. And it looks like what? Suriano's asking for some. Oh. It looks like Suriano's asking to lose the shirt. Says he keeps slipping off a of fix. The official didn't seem as into that idea as Nick Suriano was. <laughs> Action, guys. Let's go. We've seen both guys in deep. We've seen both guys defend. We've seen some great scrambling. Dayton Fix gets in on the leg here in the middle of the mat. Oh, and Suriano. Oh, amazing scramble. Oh, great Fix is in deep. He's got Suriano off the mat. Suriano gets rolled through. Fix hanging on. Suriano coming to the angle. Now Suriano is in on the leg. Over on the edge. Nick Suriano has the ankle. Dayton Fix mostly out of bounds. What's going to happen here? Suriano looking to score. He's close. Fix holding on the edge. Don't touch the shorts. Don't grab shorts. Don't grab shorts. Can Suriano finish this? He's close. He's got to put Dayton Fix on his butt. Here's your two. Oh, the marathon mask. The mask that was never in. Finally, keep it going. Keep it going. Must keep it on now. Unbelievable. Come here. Go to the side. 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 That was something else, folks. A world record. Over.